This is Daily Dose of Daryl entitled Savor. Many people don't take enough time to savor life. Now, how long would it take you to eat a few nuts, a couple of strawberries, half a banana, a piece of candy, and some peanut butter? Not very long. You can knock that out and be on your way. But how about if you take time to prepare it and to savor it? What's the value in that? It's just wasting time. No, time is very valuable. It's like money. It's how you spend it and how you invest it that's so important. For instance, as you take time to savor each bite and each kind of glance at it and to take it in, you have a chance to reflect. I think of peanut butter and bananas as Elvis Presley. Whoever thought I'd be living right near where he stopped to eat his hamburger out in Whitsit. Well, there I am. And it gave me time to think about my times of turning into Elvis. And so just that time to look at that banana and peanut butter brought flashbacks and memories of good times of sharing joy with people. And I took the time to eat one bite at a time and reflected on so many neat experiences just from the thought of that peanut butter and banana. Yep, I remember the lady that took the time to custom make that outfit. Just a neat character over in Greensboro from the Chicago Fashion Show. And the time of trying to figure out how the old man could turn into Elvis was a real uh, challenge. But as I went through each bite, I remembered special friends like this young lady who's now in heaven, that it brought so much joy to her. And waiting until the very end, and then the thoughts of a good friend who is now a full citizen and helping celebrate her citizenship here. And stretching it out to have just another bite to remind me of a dear friend who was born the same time as Elvis Presley and certainly loves to celebrate. And and then you think the plate is empty, but no, it's not empty because now you've filled your mind and your, your spirit with good memories that last. You've taken time to savor just that simple meal. And my good buddy from high school who helped guard Elvis Presley in his past. So, as you savor the moment, notice the little things that can make a day special. The smile of a friend, the kindness of a stranger, the beauty of a sunset. Notice and enjoy what's around you moment by moment and it's almost impossible to stress and how important that is even today. It says making the best use of the time because the days are evil. And 2020 was not evil as much as so many seemingly bad things happened. So teach us to number our days that we may get the heart of wisdom. And of course, true wisdom comes from God. Daily Dose of Daryl Saver. That's my phone number. Text me or call me. Go to my, send me an email there or go to the website. I'm encouraging you to savor life. Allow time for God to add wisdom. Relish each moment. Cherish your friends. Value the life you have and treasure it. And then go have a great day. Make it a great day. It's the only one you have. And share it with others so that God can really deepen your blessing. God bless you.